So while she's working on that, I can fix this broken glass here. Uh, this glass has been broke for probably years. Um, and Honey Baby said something about it being broke the other day. She said every time she looks at it, she felt guilty for breaking it. And I didn't even remember that she did break it. I don't. I didn't even remember how it got broke, but I figured maybe it just fell apart. But she is sort of implying that she'd feel better if it was fixed. And, uh, really, it wouldn't take much to pull that door down, take that glass out, run up the hardware store, except for it is snowing today, so a little, little bit of concern on the hardware store, but I can pop that door off and uh, take the glass out and get a measurement and uh, put it up there. And, uh, I expect there won't be a lot of people at the hardware store today with it being snowing and all, so I figured they'd get it done. I'm setting this on this piece of paper so that we can catch all those little pieces of lead paint. We might want to eat them later with some kind of dip. Uh, maybe some hummus or you know something like that. No point in wasting them, let them fall in the floor and such as that. Uh, I don't know how many of y'all have ever changed a window before give you a little quick lesson on how it's done. Generally there's going to be a little metal piece that holds the windows in. Uh, here is one right here. Can you see that? It's pretty darn tiny. Got a little putty right there. If I can get a hold of it though, pull it out and see it's sharp so you Kind of drive that into the wood uh, once you get the glass on there and you put your putty on top of that. Now I'm going to kind of mark that spot or at least remember that it was right. I'm going to try to remember right where it was. I'll just put it that way. But I think I can take my little Leatherman knife and just scrape off. Let's see if I can get my knife open. I'm actually holding the camera. I do uh, the camera and working and making video and all at the same time, but that old putty just coming right out of there. It's pretty old and dried up. There's another spike right there. You see it? The tip of my knife is on. And, uh, grab it out. Probably have a couple spikes on each side. That's not what you call those, by the way. They're not called spikes. They're called, somebody help me. What is that? a name for them. Uh, little window. Little window bannies. Uh, I can't think of it, though. I got some, got some extra ones out in the barn there. Put y'all back on your holder over here so I can get my... Oh, you know what? I'm taking out the good one. Hang on. Or am I? Am I? Am, yeah. I didn't want to do that. See, that's how smart I am. I'm so smart. And I'll come start popping the good glass out and leave the broken glass. So, that's easy enough to fix. I can replace some of this crappy stuff. And just like I just pulled them out, I'll just stick them right back in. Gentle little tap tap from a screwdriver or something. But it would be a good idea to take and scrub off some of this stuff. This old putty. Alright, so now that I pulled out the wrong ones. Right when I should have pulled out right there. I should have got that one. It's here. This one has one, but it's bent. Let me straighten it out. Yeah. 
I'll grab me a measurement, run up to the hardware store and get me another piece of that cut and we'll come back and put it in here and when I get back I'll fix some of these other bad looking areas around in here too.